Hey everyone, uh, we are going to be talking today about how to obtain better active knee extension. Now we just did a ton of video clips on how to obtain good passive knee extension, but once you start to get close to getting that knee extension, you really need to activate the quads. And one of the ways we like to do that is through biofeedback, so that the patient can actively contract their quad a little bit better. So what we're going to do is, uh, we have her hooked up, we have biofeedback on the VMO, and we're going to ask her to push, tighten up that quad, push her knee down into the table, and she's getting probably like two microvolts, which really isn't a lot. So in order for us to get her to activate a little bit, we're going to give her something to push against. So I'm going to put my hand under there, and sometimes just putting a small towel is enough. So go ahead and push down into my hand, push hard, push hard, push hard. And you can hear we now have met the goal, and relax. Okay, I usually have them hold for about three seconds each time. So I want you to go ahead and tighten again. Push, 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 push. Take a look at it. That little bar needs to hit the arrow so they get immediate feedback and rest. The other thing we look at is for the, for the patella to be migrating superiorly. That's very important. So we're going to do this with some support, but then we're going to take the hand out and we're going to have her push into full extension to try to get her extension. So once she can get a good strong quad, she's going to maintain her extension way better than just doing it passively all the time. Thanks.